It's crazy what you can achieve. You know, I always tell people it doesn't matter your hardship or what you're going through at the moment. You can do anything. And I always tell them my story and I'm like, if I can do it, like you can do it. Like I'm no different than you. I always tell people that because if I would have given up the first time, I would not be where I am today. I'm Paige Hathaway. I'm a social media influencer, fitness model, cover model. I have over 10 million followers on social media. What's up, you guys? <laughs> a lot of people describe me as a super hard worker, and I'm really passionate about what I do. I grew up in the Midwest in a small town. I am an army brat. My mom's side lived in Minnesota. My dad's side lived in Oklahoma. They got divorced at a really young age, so I moved back a ton growing up. I ended up growing up a lot with my grandma most of my life. When I was about 16 years old, I moved out on my own. So I was just kind of set to kind of figure out life by myself. I did that for a while and I just felt kind of lost. And I was like, is this what life is really about? Like just working and not really feeling fulfilled. So when I was about 24 years old, I was approached by a guy who was opening a gym in Oklahoma. And he was like, you know what? I just see something in you and I think that you could be a fitness model. I was just like, you're crazy. Like this vision that you have is just bizarre. One day I was like, you know what? What do I have to lose? And so I trained for a bikini show and I just fell in love with it. I just felt like I had a purpose and a passion for something. Finally in my life, I felt fulfilled. I went from 100 pounds to 130 pounds. When you change that, you not only become more confident, but it does affect the mind because now I feel like, wow, if I can do that, I can do anything. I trained for my first show and instead of doing a small show in Oklahoma, I was like, let's go big or go home. And I did the biggest show in the US and I got second, so I was on cloud nine. And then from there, I just had this newfound passion for health and fitness. After I did bikini shows, I kind of went back to the drawing board and I was like, okay, what else can I do that can get me to where I wanna be? Everything wasn't working. Like I would apply for things, no one would write me back. And one year I was like, I'm gonna make comp cards and go to Olympia, which is one of the biggest expos in the US. I made my little comp cards and I had my email address on it and my picture and I went and I just passed out comp cards. Who knew if that did anything at all? But I was still building my social media and posting consistently and writing motivational things that really connect to my audience. And through that time, I had a supplement company reach out to me and they were looking for the face of their company. And so I went out and I got the job. I got to be the face of the company. The next year, I went to Olympia and I had the biggest banner at Olympia. My banner touched the ceiling. Oh, I just get goosebumps just thinking about it because the year before that, I was just a girl with teeny tiny picture comp cards. And now the next year I had the biggest poster that there was. And that was my like aha moment. Today is a video about my life. Seven years ago, it was such a stigma that if you lifted weights, you were gonna look like a man. So being on Instagram and being feminine and wearing makeup, it was such a difference to people. They're like, wait a minute, you can lift weights and still be feminine? So that's how my Instagram started to grow at a rapid pace. One thing I've learned about myself is my willpower to do anything in life has just exceeded my expectations. I didn't know I had that in me. And I grew up not having a lot. We, I grew up in a trailer. I didn't have the picture perfect life and the picture perfect parents. And just looking back, I would never, ever would I have imagined that I could accomplish everything that I have now. Sometimes I, you know, I have to step back and like look at my life and say like, wow, like you did this. Like you, you really did this. This is amazing. I always tell people, it doesn't matter your hardship or where you've come from or what you're going through at the moment, you can do anything. And I always tell them my story and I'm like, if I can do it, like you can do it. Like I'm no different than you. I always tell people that because if I would have given up the first time, I would not be where I am today.
everyone. So be sure to stay tuned. Next week, I'm releasing a sweet sweat recipe. I'm really excited about it. It's gonna be a good one. So make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and look out for next week.